petrified fish grow. The price was good, pretty well centered, good thickness on the blade. G mask, I like that pattern. Dark gray and green. Knife feels a lot more premium than uh, under a $50 knife. The flipper works great. Runs on bearings with the brass races and steel bolts. Very minimal blade decoration. Achilles heel of all the button lock knives. The surface is engaging the blade. And as you can see, it's a minimal engagement in one and a half millimeter. So for the button to travel and compress the spring, you'd normally want to see a little more thickness. Milled looking pocket clip with a hidden hardware. It hides in the pocket really well. Looks a lot more expensive than it is. And the tip is very thin and slicey. I hope you don't think it's all glitter and unicorns. Yeah, didn't take much. If it is not a heavy duty work tool, don't be seduced by the fact that it's a tool steel. The closer look, you can see that the tip was deformed. This steel is very hard, so it took a while to resharpen the knife. Hit like if you think more people should know about this knife.